Well, I've been really busy. Here's my suitcases I'm packing. All that stuff in there goes to the thrift store on the next thrift store run. <clears throat> that stuff's garbage. My cameras. This stuff over here, that goes to the thrift store. This stuff is prospecting gear, which I have a buyer for. That's some of it. That's a guitar case, goes with the guitar. This stuff over here is thrift store stuff. That's laundry. A lot of the stuff's disappearing from here. I'm getting rid of it. Let's check on the mash. Oh, well, the temperature's right. And... Oh, I can still hear it brewing. Yeah. Well, maybe I can run it this afternoon. That'd be nice. So I've been busy, busy here. Some of the people have asked for some of my stainless steel pots and pans. But, yeah. We'll come back where we can get a better look. This whole pile, this whole place is clearing out. <coughs> of course, my computer comes with me. I'm still working the gold. Still got lots to do in here. Yeah. So the prospecting gear, that's the got a buyer for. All of it. All the gold equipment. Okay. The distilling equipment I have a buyer for. The electric bike, I'm hoping Chris is going to buy it off me. Um, if I put it together for him, I'll charge him 300 If not, if he wants to build it, then 200 takes it. And it's got two motors, it's got solar charge system, it's got a five phase charge system, it's three batteries come with it, and yeah, the big batteries that are right there. Okay. Uh, over here, uh, remember that pile that was there? Yeah, that's all gone. Okay. The DVDs, I have a buyer for that and its machine. So, it's just the vinyl records. And yes, they're all Motown labels or Disney, original Disney from the 1940s and 1950s and earlier. And there's even some records in there from the 1930s, uh, I think the not early 40s that I have, yes. And the recording machine, which I'm hoping my brother will take because he'll appreciate it more. And the guitar and amp and it's stuff still needs a uh, buyer. So, I am making progress here. Things are coming together just fine. So, yeah. Um, on these cloudy, cold days where it's threatening rain, you know. This is what I do. I sit inside and I'm busy doing this and I'm busy cleaning the house and clearing it out and getting rid of everything. I don't know what I'm going to do with these oil paintings. I don't know where they're going to go. I haven't got a clue yet. But yeah, I'm making progress so that I can go to the Philippines and be with my darling love, Rosilda, and spend the rest of my life there. Yeah. Yeah, after the, the shit I've seen and gone through here, I'm not wanting too many people to know that I'm leaving, or when I'm leaving, actually when I'm leaving, because last January, when I was telling everyone when I was going to go, that's when that guy came over and tried to kill me. I still have a broken rib in the back, back and down in here. Yeah, and two people ripped me off for some money. And now even Rosilda's accusing me of doing things I'm not doing. 
So I have to go there and prove to her that I am an honest man because that's what I pride myself on being is an honest man. I'm tolerant, I'm gentle, I'm understanding, and I'm patient, but even I can only take so much bullshit, right? Okay? So, my message is positive. My meaning is stern. People, I'm leaving North America because North America is not a nice place to live anymore. I'm only hoping the next place is a lot nicer. And the people there better fucking make it so. They better make it a nice place. Or I won't stay there either. I'll keep going until I find the right place to live. Where people are kind and treat people with respect. That's what I want out of life. It's my life. You don't own it. I was born with it. It's mine.